Back in 2015, I believe, was when I all started going into this world of like online and e-commerce and Amazon. Uh, I wasn't born an entrepreneur. I was not interested in entrepreneurship um, for most of my life. I'm 37 years old today. And um, when I was like 32 years old, I already have three kids. And I felt that I wanted to accomplish more in life. And somebody talked to me about the opportunity of the Amazon world. And for a second, I thought about that and I thought it was uh, interesting, but I didn't really have a passion about it just yet. But something woke up along the way. I started observing in the environment and I pay attention. And based on what's going on, I actually just go in there and uh, try to do something with that thing that I'm observing. Started to observe what's going on in the environment. And I saw people using their devices nonstop and these smartphones everywhere they went to. And it was kind of like incredible to see that because I saw the massively changing universe of the online world. And, and, and just try to see how I can take advantage of that particular opportunity that we have in front of us. Because we're not gonna suddenly stop using these devices. We're not gonna stop using the online world. It's not gonna change. It's only gonna evolve from now on. It's gonna get better with time and improve. And we wanna just jump into that wave because it's just basically beginning. I have a total reality of what it is to not have anything, okay? And I take that as something very seriously to heart because I think there's a massive opportunity for all of us that most people that are not in this room take for granted. See the internet as something that is normal. We complain when the internet gets too slow. Uh, we um, throw fits about Facebook changing the algorithm, uh, about YouTube being hard to rank in, and all those different things that our great grandparents never even dreamed about, or like our own fathers never even thought about being able to use it for business. Do I take that for granted? I have decided that I'm not going to. And I want you guys to also have that viewpoint because instead of complaining about how difficult it is, we should realize how unique the opportunity is. And in reality, most people don't even understand this opportunity. Only a couple of people are actually taking advantage of that wave. The ones that are actually making the money there right now are the pioneers back in 2005 in the Amazon Prime world, right? I learned to always give more than what people expect from me, always. Always make sure that people feel like they owe me, no matter what. So if somebody pays for something, I'm gonna make sure that they get 10 times as much as that. Here, let's do a little survey. Raise your hand if you yourself has your, have your own Facebook account. Raise your hand, look around. Everybody, keep them up and look around, okay? You see that? Why would you go anywhere else? Why? Why are you gonna invest on a, a television ad, in a magazine, on a print, on a media mail, on, uh, on, on Twitter, on Pinterest, or anywhere else where you have a platform which is still really affordable today that you can find all these people in there. I've, I've been one of the ones that have been obsessed about it since it came into existence. And I did it myself. I actually got so like, I was like a little kid on a playground building messenger channels and sequences and all that stuff. And, and, and we have strategies that work really well. And right now it's really cheap. So the opportunity is just basically beginning. So based on that and what was going on in the market, I decided to not take any of that stuff for granted and work hard at building businesses, building brands, taking advantage of the opportunities. And it all started with Ben, which is something that, that's why no matter how much, like right now I'm selling millions of dollars in Amazon, I'm doing like $1.7 million every single month, a couple of different accounts. Uh, I sell several million dollars more on my own e-commerce platforms. I have an agency with 45 staff uh, in which I help some businesses. Uh, if you guys are wondering, no, I'm not up for hire right now, okay? Um, and, uh, and, and in that business, we have some big clients, including my own dad. My own dad has a business called uh, Natural Slim. It's a weight loss clinic that so we are in eight countries. We took it from a small little island in Puerto Rico to eight countries uh, around the world and doing over $40 million in revenue. It's actually cheaper to get a messenger subscriber than an email, way cheaper right now. And not only that, even though it's cheaper, the open rates are four times as much, okay? So opportunities, right? Guys, opportunities come and go. It's only just beginning. The evolution of these platforms are only getting better. I would tell you guys that it would be really, really, really smart of every single one of you guys to become obsessed about two companies, Amazon and Facebook. If you do that, I guarantee you you're gonna be just fine because those are the ones that are taking over the world. And as long as Jeff Bezos and Mark Zuckerberg are alive, they're gonna keep on dominating and dominating and dominating. So that's what's, that's what's gonna keep on happening for a while.